Why they lying on my name, on my soul? I can't lose control when you do the most. What's my hope? I can't lose my soul. I can't lose no more. I chill, what is going on guys, and say we're back with another banger video, and in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we have Ask Souls episode 5, so if you're new to this series and you don't know how it works, comment down below, Ask Souls, colon, put your question, and you'll have a chance to be featured in the next week's video, I'll answer your questions live on camera, and yeah, we got a decent amount of questions today, so let's get through it. Yeah, if you're new to the channel, take a second out of your day, hit that subscribe button, because we post Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. Four times a week, which is probably better than your favorite YouTuber. Unless what? Unless, of course, I'm your favorite YouTuber. Oh, let's just get into it. First question we got is, ask Souls, when are you doing Will's room tour? And this was the most liked question. Um, I know I pro we promised the room tour, like, back in October. October. So the fact that you guys are still wanting that is crazy. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest. Will's been very busy lately, and he actually might, well, he's gonna, he, he, just, just know Will, the reason you haven't seen him in videos, he's just going through family stuff right now, so that's just pretty much the reason, so just let Will rock, um, that's, that's pretty much it, Will's been working, he's got, he's busy, he's a busy person, so, yeah, but, I, we'll film it one day, eventually, just one day, I can't, I literally can't tell you when. Next, ask Souls, when did your beard kick in? I, will, I always remember you not having one. Well, um... You know, if if you watched me, if you watch, if you're like a real like subscriber and watches like every video and goes crazy, you would have heard me say it multiple times that in like different types of videos, I guess, saying that I um I in case you didn't know, I shave every night. Like I'm talking about the past four years of my life since high school started, I shaved every night to not keep the beard. So when the beard kicked in. That was literally me not shaving for a week, then two weeks, then three weeks. That was the longest I've ever gone without shaving. Again, remember, I would, I either shave every night or every other night. Like, as you can tell, it, I just got, like, stubbles because I literally shaved last night and I already have this, like, stubbly. So, my facial hair grows very quick. So, the reason you never saw it is because I shave every night. Ask souls, where do you see yourself in 10 years? <sighs> 10 years, 10 years. So, what's the year right now? It is 2021. So 2031, damn, that's crazy to say. That's crazy to say. Um, I would be 28 years old and I will probably be working for a company or my own company designing sneakers, whether it's my company or somebody else's company, I'll be designing sneakers. Um, still be doing YouTube on the side, nice little side hustle. Um, Cause YouTube is just like, I just love to do YouTube. So it's not like, and plus if I'm gonna be a sneaker designer, that's cool content for YouTube. So. Yeah, um, probably just still making videos, you know, sneaker type videos, maybe other types of videos. I don't know, just going crazy, you know, you know me. Probably 10 years from now, maybe be, maybe, uh, I don't know, I don't know, 10 years from now, that's crazy. I can't even, again, probably just something with a sneaker company. That's all I can say. So ask souls, what's your opinion on Mitch, oh, why can't I speak, <laughs> on mismatching brands in an outfit? Puma shoes with Nike shirt, Adidas with Jordans, etc. There's, all right, so there's two types of mismatching your fits. If you're gonna wear Adidas shoes, right? You're gonna have Nike socks, you have shorts on. You have Nike socks on. You got, I don't know, Puma shorts, like, and then a big Nike logo on your chest. Like, that's a little OD. But then there's also, I have some clothing pieces. I have some Jordan cargo pants that you wouldn't really know were Jordan, and I might wear them with some Adidas. I might wear them with some Pumas because they just look like normal cargo pants. Like you can't really tell they're Jordan. So it depends, it depends. Just like, but yeah, I understand what you're saying. Like, it's just a little weird sometimes if you see like a huge Puma logo on your shirt and then you're wearing like Nike shoes. Like, I know what you mean. So I don't know, it, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Because again, if something's low key, because I have, I have a Puma, I have a whole Puma jumpsuit that is very low key. You wouldn't know it's Puma. It's got like a small Puma logo, but it mainly just looks like a jumpsuit type thing. And I wore some Air Forces with it, but like you couldn't really tell it's Puma. So again, it just depends. Ask Souls, what is the best Puma sneaker ever made? Big fan from Denmark. Hey, shout out my Denmark gang. Denmark gang. Um, best Puma sneaker ever made. Are we going classic or like newer? Cause obviously like 
Puma suede. I need to get a pair of Puma suede ASAP. I don't know why I still haven't got a pair of Puma suede, but Puma suede are definitely up there. Um, as of right now, though, my personal favorite would definitely be my Puma RSX. Um, where are they? Whatever, whatever those are, the RSX3, I think. Ask Souls, what is your intro song? Oh my God, what is your intro song? Guys, 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 girls, females, males, whatever you classify as. It is linked down below. I, I Even with the old intro song, even with the Michael Jackson one by TJ Porter, I get questions. What's the intro song, what's the intro song? Bro, like look in the description. Same thing with this one. The, the intro song is Lose Control by J.I. The link is in the description. The link is in the description. The link is in the description. If you ever hear any types of songs, check the description before commenting. But to counter that, um, I don't really put like if I do like B-roll shots, you probably won't see like a song unless I say it is. You know what I mean? Ask Souls, would you rather collab with Bape or Supreme? Bape, because I wanna. I, if I was gonna collab with Bape, I'd want. I'd do a couple pieces, but the main piece I'd want to do is a shark hoodie. I would do like a like a crazy like I do a full zip up hoodie. Um, I'd probably do what else would I do with Bape? Probably some Bape studs would be dope. Um, I would do a nice little Bape shirt too. Yeah, I feel like Bape. I feel like Bape. I would. Yeah, if I'm a collab with somebody, I do babe. Ask Souls, what was your family and friends' first reaction to you being a YouTuber? So I don't think there's there's really like not like a first reaction. Like it's not like, oh my god, he does YouTube. Like that's not really how it works. It's just like, um, like you know, I told my mom about it. She was cool with it. She was like, all right, like she didn't really understand at the time. She was like, okay. Um, but then like when my I guess when like my family found out. They, they were supportive, like I'm not gonna say they weren't, like everybody was supportive, like it's not like, YouTube isn't like, oh my god, like YouTube is just like, cool, like, they're like, oh you can make money off this, oh, like you got a following, like that's crazy, like, that, like you know what I mean, like it's not something that's like, I don't know, like it's not bad, <laughs> like, it, like, I don't know, that question kind of sounds weird, it's like, what was your family and first reaction to you being a YouTuber, it sounds like I'm like breaking the law or something, but, um, nah, I know what you mean, um, yeah, it was just nothing, nothing bad, uh, you said friends too, well, for the most part, all my friends are support. Like, it's like somebody my my friends are my age. They understand how the internet works. So yeah, it's just like oh like yeah YouTube like yeah like like get on that. You you got the personality for it. You could do it. You got the sneakers. You got the everything for it. Do it. Ask souls places to get jewelry. So I get a question. I get questions a lot about my necklaces. Um, this necklace again. Y'all always ask me where I get this necklace. This is this was my grandpa's. It is not mine. So I can't tell you where to get it. But my rings and stuff, it's kind of just random. Like, I just be getting jewelry randomly. Like, there's no, like, place I can tell you to get jewelry. Um, like, Leanne will surprise me with jewelry. Um, me and Leanne made, like, you know those rings I have with the smiley faces on? Me and Leanne bought a kit off Amazon, and we made those rings. Like, we made those. Like, we made those rings. Y'all always ask me where I got my smiley face, like, the gold one and then the pearl one. Y'all always ask me where I got them. Like, I made that. Like, we made that. You can search it up on Amazon. Search up, like, a ring-making cake kit and yeah that's, that's what we did um all my other jewelry like it's just like random like it's just random spots i'll be finding stuff like it's not really like i honestly don't know where to get jewelry like again it's just yeah i, I just it just falls it just comes to me like jewelry just comes to me ask souls what is your next top when is your next top 10 affordable shoes so i'm not gonna promise it but i'm thinking this week so this video comes out on monday so i'm thinking i'm gonna make top 10 uh, sneakers under 100 2021 updated list da, 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 or whatever. I don't know the title yet, but just know sneakers under 100 um, And I'm gonna be throwing y'all some steals I'm gonna try to do some different types of sneakers not like just like Air Forces and blazers and like stuff like that So my next top 10 affordable shoes will probably be Friday or Saturday Maybe even Wednesday. I don't want to say Wednesday, but You know who knows who knows when Sometime this week we'll say just maybe maybe sometime this week So stay tuned turn on post notifications if, if you don't have post notifications on what are you doing? Like, hit that post notification. Ask Souls, who are your top three favorite mods? My favorite mods? I can't pick that. If y'all don't know what that is, if you don't know what a moderator is, it's uh, on my second channel. I do live streams and uh, you have to, I have mods to control the chat so the chat doesn't say some stupid stuff. Start like if some hater comes in or like just like somebody random and they start saying some, you know, really messed up stuff. Like the mods delete it because I'll be playing so I can't focus on the chat the entire time. So the chat be deleting it. But, um, uh, the mods be deleting it, I should say. So my mods, I got, I think, five mods. And everybody always asks me to be a mod, but, like, if you were on the first live stream ever on that channel, 
I said to the people, the people that are mods, um, I said, all right, y'all. So they were like the first five to join. I was like, y'all are gonna join every stream? They're like, yes, yes, yes. And I made them mods. So yeah, I'm sorry, but my second channel gang is lit. Whether you're a mod or not, like the whole second channel gang is lit when we're in live streams. Everybody, everybody's just mad fun, just vibing with me. And yeah, so I don't have a top three favorite mods. I can't say that. And yeah, sorry, Wida. If you know who Wida is, it's the person that commented this, but uh, Wida, live stream gang knows. Ask Souls, what made you cut your hair? Um, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know, I just, I literally just, I don't know, I just woke up one day and I was just like, you know what, I'm tired of uh, having like a poof and like dealing with it, but yeah, so when, when my hair grows back in, I'm definitely going to grow the curls back in, but the thing is, I don't want my hair to be as big as it was. I kind of want tighter, like not tighter, but just like smaller curls, like, like, like more down to my head, not like how it was, you know what I mean? Like I just kind of want... Like I'll go to the barber and I'll make sure that they don't, like it doesn't grow OD like how it was. Kind of just smaller type curls. If you remember from last year when I shaved my head and you were watching like my hair progression, just like just by watching the videos, like it wasn't like a specific video, but like you saw my hair grow, grow, grow. And there was a point where it was just like little, it was like kind of smaller curls and it was just very like compact to my head. And I kind of liked that better. So yeah, I just kind of wanted to start over again. <laughs> Re restart over ask souls. Can you keep your beard and just shape it up whenever it grows shout out Mari, but uh um, Yeah, obviously she commented this before I shaved it again, but Yeah, again, I, I didn't mind the beard a lot of you seem to like the beard some of you didn't like the beard and Yeah, again, again as I said earlier in this video It's something that I could just grow back in literally a week. It's not like it's not like it's gone like I'll probably the only reason I really cut it is because it was just kind of annoying me, and um, I don't know, I felt like I looked really old, and I don't want to be that old yet. Like, you know, maybe when I'm like 20-something, I'll grow the beard in like fully and go crazy. But when I was looking at myself, I was like, bro, I look like I'm 20-something. Like, I looked like I was 20, I'm 18, I'm 18. Why do I look like I'm 20-something with a beard? Ask Souls, do you have regular classes at college, or are they all about fashion and shoes? So I get this question a lot. A lot of people think that FIT is just some like, you know, it's not like real school, but like y'all gotta realize that what I'm doing is hard regardless Like yeah, it might not be math science English social studies like like your core classes like that like a normal person going to college would be but like Yeah, like some of these classes are hard too. Like it's just not what you're used to you know what I mean, but um I do some people have normal classes it depends again. It all depends um, the only normal class I have at the moment is physics because I have to take, it's called G classes. I have to take a G class at least like once or something throughout my next two semesters or twice. I don't know, but I picked physics because it was like intro to physics. So it seemed like the easiest out of the list. Like the list was crazy. You just, trust me, physics is hard, but out of everything else on that list, that physics was the easiest out of all that. So um, yeah, but I have, again, the only regular class, regular class, I guess you could say is physics, but my other classes are footwear design too, uh, handbag design too. Uh, Photoshop, yeah, that's, a, that's the class, Photoshop. Um, what else? What else, what other class do I have? Oh, I have uh, technical drawing for accessories and I have art in New York and then physics. So yeah, I guess I don't have regular classes besides physics, but um, yeah, I guess they're all about fashion and shoes, but like, don't, don't think, don't make that sound like it's easy because it's not easy. Ask Souls, I live in Chapel Hill, NC, where UNC is. I know that besides FIT, UNC was your favorite for you. Would you, would slash did you ever consider going to UNC? So if you've been subscribed to the channel for a minute, I've always said that UNC is my favorite college. And it's not because, that was like when I was little, when I was like seven, um, my grandma actually lived in North Carolina. So during the summers, I would go down there and I really like, like, you know, you know, they, they were, they were proud about their college. So North Car like UNC was always dope to me. I loved the colors of it. I loved like, it was cool. But once I got older, I was like, UNC is still like adult college, like it's still cool, but it had nothing that I would go there for. You know what I mean? Like when I got into high school and I actually started learning about colleges, uh, actually not even high school, like middle school. Cause I knew what I wanted to do in middle school. I wanted to be a sneaker designer. And I knew that FIT was the place that I had to go because one, it's in New York. Two, it's just the best one out of all the colleges for sneaker design. And yeah, so no, I was, I never really was gonna go to UNC. It's just a dope college. Like it was just like, like I was just a fan of UNC, I guess. All right, y'all, so that's pretty much it. That was Ask Souls episode five. Make sure you smash that like button for episode six and 
make sure you leave a comment down below so you could be in the next week's episode again you could ask any questions down below they don't have to be sneaker related it doesn't have to be fashion related it can be any type of questions or it can be sneaker related and fashion related questions literally any questions down below appreciate them and yeah i'll catch you on the next one make sure you go follow me on instagram at paul.souls grind to 13,000 followers on there we're, i think we're almost about to hit 13k on instagram uh subscribe right now we're about to hit 52k if we didn't hit it already and Grind to that 100k, 100k by the end of the year. We out, y'all. I love y'all. Have a blessed day. Catch y'all on the next one. <laughs> Bye. I wanna run up the money. I love with the music. I do it with passion. Yeah. You see me thumbing through hundreds for all this designer. I love with the fashion.